development. And this decision is going to affect more than just athletes and fans. Central Illinois businesses and restaurants are going to take a hit. WCI3's Gabrielle Cook live in our newsroom. And Gabrielle, a lot of businesses rely on support from fans. Many think of hotels, restaurants, and bars being affected with a lack of Illini fans, but I also spoke with a screen printing clothing company who says this is going to hurt. Been around 45 years, and so we've seen highs and lows. This is just one of the lowest lows that we've had. So uh, we just kind of go with the flow. Stan Sports World in Champaign has sold U of I promotional products and clothes in the past, such as shirts for football and basketball. When sports seasons roll around, it's their prime sales time. But with the Big Ten postponing fall sports, their pockets could take a huge hit. There's so much revenue, A, through the university that football gives to them, which then is a trickle-down effect, which they, if they start cutting sports, would be huge for us. Bars and restaurants near campus also depend on revenue from fans. One of them is the restaurant Cracked. Football really does brings like a lot of customers and stuff. And basketball, you know, like, you know, since they like a D1 school and stuff, a lot of people call out there, they have like sometimes sold out stadiums and stuff. And so after the games and stuff, we'll still be open and, you know, they won't be able to come because it's like no games and stuff. So it will actually make me a little nervous. With so much uncertainty in the college sports world, Kraft is considering new marketing tactics to help themselves and other businesses. I really want to make a, like a flyer sheet, you know, to start sending out to like all these like uh, apartment buildings and stuff, car car complexes and stuff, because I know it's a lot of them that just got built this year. So it's like I would really want to like send out stuff like that and having like all the small businesses on it. Both of those businesses tell me they hope the Champaign Urbana community realizes the benefits of buying local and hope they keep them in mind when they do. Jennifer. All right, Gabrielle, thank you.